Well, lads, what's the crack? My name is Orgy Runner, and welcome back to Until Dawn, part number nine. Right, so what is the current objective of this game? I forget. It's been a few days since I've played it last, so... Status and collectibles. Current objective, find Mike. Ah, uh -huh, of course. Mike went off to find... Sam? No, 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 not Sam. He went off to find Matt. He went off to find Matt, I think. And now we're trying to meet up with Mike, or trying to find Mike ourselves, to see if we can save his ass. Or, at least, th that's what I recall. Like I said, it's been a few days since I've played this game, and I'm just after finishing up uh, Life, Life is Strange. Awesome game, by the way. I was more in tune with that than I was with this game for some reason or another. Even though they share similar aspects in terms of, you know, the butterfly effect, in that each action has a consequence. And that's about it. But either way, getting back right into it. Okay, come on. What's your name? Chris. Jesus Christ, these characters are so forgettable. Maybe it's because there's just so many names to remember. Because I am terrible with names from time to time. Right, so we're going into the deep, dark, dank abyss of the hotel, I think. Or is it the asylum? I think it's the asylum. Wait, was there a way to fast walk in this? Oh, 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 wait, what, what, what did I see behind here? Is this a thing? Oh, yeah, it is a thing. There's a totem here. What the hell? Was that Sam? Or not Sam. Fucking Matt, I meant. Did Matt get bitten and transform into a Wendigo? Whoops, whoops, didn't mean to do that. Or you could just use your womanly strength to open it. You know, I do believe in female empowerment and whatnot. You sure? You sure about that? Come on. Push! Oh, push? No. Okay, fine. We tried. I guess we don't have the strength. So, further... Into the sewer we go, I guess. Wait, hey, what about this? I mean, should, should we try it? Oh, it's not like we got a whole lot of choices here. And of course, we're going to use this handily placed little iron bar to open it up. There we go. Easy peasy. No, don't bother helping us, Chris. Okay, this is maybe the last place I would want to be right now. Yeah, God knows what's down there. After you. It's not so bad. Yeah, no, after you, Sam. This is the tunnel to the sanatorium? Of course it is. Where else would it go? To a sewer? Come on, get your fine ass down there. Chris, I know you're hurt, but you gotta move it, all right? I'm trying, Ash. I mean, you can't be hurt that bad. What do you do? Sprain your ankle? Watch this now. This is the part where I get kidnapped. Hey, um, hey, we should close this, right? Huh? I mean, what if something's following us? Yeah, fine, close it, but you gotta keep moving. Just catch up, please. Yeah. Oh, this is where something bad happens. Oh, no, okay. Normally, 
That's the part where you get lifted up by the head and dragged into the abyss. No? Hey, hey guys. Guys, where you go? Jesus. They poured on ahead of me. Well, fuck you guys. Why'd you bend me like that? Why would you do such a horrible, horrible thing? Who's there? Anybody? Jessica! Is it you? Oh, I don't like that. I could investigate the voice or I could join up the group. No, she's dead, remember? She's definitely dead. Am I stuck down here? Oh, no. Oh, this is such a bad idea. Oh God. This is a bad idea. Oh, look, another toady woody. Oh, that was bad. Looks like somebody was getting their head crushed. Hello? Who we banging? Who's banging here? Yeah, let's ignore that. <gasps> oh, I saw that. I saw that. Who knows, maybe Jessica is down here. Oh, suddenly stopped. Are you worried? Hello? me oh I need oh I knew that was bad oh Jesus oh I knew it I knew it I knew it I knew it, I knew it. I had no idea that it was a Wendigo impersonating Jessica. Oh god. Oh, that was such a dumbass move to make. Oh god. I should have ignored it. Oh! That's Josh. He is uh, pretty much dead. Oh, great. Oh, shit. Shit, dead end. No, 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 I think I can. I think I can do it. It's like a rock wall. Well, you're definitely dressed for it. I mean, I've gotta keep going. you look like you're ready to tackle Everest. Yeah, stick Damn. together. That that's the best idea. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I have to get Mike with you or without you. Just make it back, okay? Okay, I'm gonna take a leap of faith. There you go. Oh. Oh, nice slow motion grab there. <gasps> Come on, leap. We can do this. We can do this. Nice. Did 
Jeez, you must be pretty skilled. Can we actually go back this way? No, we can't. Just saw something glimmering here. Oh, let me guess. <gasps> oh, no, 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 no. I didn't mean to do that. Can I climb back up? No. I wanted to go to the end to see what's, what was there. Probably nothing. <gasps> Is someone dropping dynamite? Okay, guess not. Hello? Oh, this is the last place we should be. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, I guess that was one of the money ghost spirits that we killed with Mike. Yeah, this should do it. Come on, girl, you can do it. Come on. One power. Oh, there you go. And we should probably keep this as well. Just in case we need to smack a Wendigo bitch down. Climb up here, maybe? And no. <gasps> Jesus! Hey, Come on, smack him! Go on, one last time! Oh, and there goes his head. Oh, hey, Ansem, how you doing? Uh, define all right. Alive, for a start. Yeah, yeah life's good. Yeah. What the hell are you doing here anyway? I was going to warn you about the Wendigo. I think I got it. Yeah. Let's find a way down to where this fucker lives. This fucker. There's more than one, you know. Okay, ten repentance. One hour until dawn. Okay, this is the last chapter, I think. So, are we still alive? As or is Mike still alive? Or not Mike? Josh. I keep calling the wrong names. Yeah, just putting it lightly. So I I'm gonna leave you now, Josh. It's time you learn. There is more to be afraid of that can be dreamt up by the unhinged imagination of a self indulgent, spoiled little brat. You had so many people who cared about you, who were willing to help. And at every turn, you choose to push them away. Taking the piss now, Doc.
Okay, he's freaking out big time. Right, so are you really down in the mind? Oh, Jesus. You're all alone down there. Oh. oh. So you're with us now. Family. Oh, no, I'd rather not be... I'd rather not be with you. Why didn't you save us, Josh? Why did you want us to die? Oh, what is that? Oh, Jesus. Oh, that's it. Punch his head clean off. even worse oh, oh god oh this is messed up on so many levels Yeah, we're gonna to need to call the National Guard to, to take them out. Or the army. Or the navy. Not sure how they get their boats down here, though. Then don't go in there. Okay, maybe this time I'll listen to the totem and not get my head ripped off. Oh, fortune totem, so we have to set the house on fire. Good plan. I guess we're not taking a dive, are we? Fine. Or maybe we are. You can't feed your fingers. Your fingers aren't even touching the water, you idiot. Wait a minute, I thought you could break the damn heart. Well, I didn't do that. I said it was okay. I mean, like, there weren't any sharks or anything in here. Sharks? Great. Thank you. Wait, we can climb up this way, can't we? I mean, it doesn't seem the best way to go, rather than suffering from hypothermia. Oh, so this area is optional. Okay. Looks like Hannah's right. My little sister is dead. Fall killed her. I watched the color drain from her face. 
My leg is broken. I'm all alone. Stuck with. I can't read that. means she ate her my hands feel unclean my nails fell out pushed pushed out I'm I'm what I'm aching but no more cold no pain I'm getting stronger wait so Hannah ate her sister and she turned into a wendigo Oh, we're going to see one to go, Hannah. What does that mean? Did she kill her too? Her own sister? I, I don't know. How the hell could they even stay alive down here? I don't know, Michael. There has to be an answer down here. Mike. Calm down. That explains why you only found her head. Okay, I want to read this in full. A bundle of pages that Hannah used as a journal. It tells how she was trapped down to mine and starving. She took desperate action for which she felt profoundly guilty. Then her body began to change. The journal ends as incoherent scribbles. Day 1. My little sister is dead. The fall killed her. I watched the colour drain from her face. My leg is broken. I'm all alone, stuck here with Beth's body. Someone will come soon. Day 5. I've never been so hungry. It feels like my stomach is twisting around inside. I took Beth's sweater, much warmer now. She's still looking out for me. Oh, I mean, that's kind of sweet, I suppose. Day 30. I'm sorry, Beth. I have no choice. I'm dying. It's the only way I can survive anymore. If someone finds this, I'm sorry. I had to. I had no choice. Forgive me, Beth. I'm sorry. Day 33. My hands feel unclean. My nails fell out. Pushed out. I'm aching, but no more cold. No pain. I'm getting stronger. Further writing devolves into scrawls. Okay. And that's when the scrawls turn into hungry, hungry, hungry. Yeah, she... She turned into one to go... Thank God I decided to come up here. I probably was, would have uh, missed out on that piece of information. So even though it looked like both of them were killed on impact, Hannah survived. And she's probably still surviving. Somehow. Somehow, some way, and somehow we are going to come across her, I bet. And it's not going to be very, very nice. Yeah, never jinx those type of things, is what I get told in work. Like, whenever I say, ah, oh, thank God, it's a quiet day. They're like, no, Rob, don't jinx it. Because we all like slow, quiet days at work. I mean, I do, especially. Okay, so where will this lead us now? Go on, push up. Oh, push it. Oh! Jesus! That's Jess. That's Jess. Oh, Okay, we know Jess ain't alive anymore. Oh, hi. Oh god. That's a crazy pyromaniac. That's Sam's head. 
Oh, this is the worst place to be. Three, two, one, boo. Oh, it's Josh. Okay, at least we know he's still alive. Okay, that's all he needed. A bit of a slap back into reality. You would be Bennett, man. Full metal jacket. Oh, yes, I did see that. Josh, Hannah was down here for a week, a month. She dug us up. Damn. Mike. Hey, let's just get the fuck out of here. Okay. Josh, do you have the key to the cable car? Uh, yeah. Whew. No, we just have to get out. That over there? That means it's the direct way out, correct? Uh, there's no way Josh is going to make it up there. Yeah, no way. That is Josh, a steep climb. Back to tell the others we're okay. Yeah. Yeah, that's good. You bring Josh back the way we came and we'll all get to the edge. Be careful. Yeah, you too. What, you just going to throw up there? Oh. <laughs> Just like he was, how he was so casual about that. No, a bit of empty, but then I, then again, I don't uh, blame him either. Uh, yeah, um, I'm sorry about before, man. I, I messed with those guys. I was wrong. Well, thanks, dude. Now, what do we have here? Oh, yeah, another totem. What's this now? Death? Oh, that's totally death. Or fortune. Alright, Josh, you fucked up, son of a bitch. Let's go. You're just gonna struggle behind me like so? Okay, or struggle behind Mike. Well, to each his own. Suppose we're in a kind of uh, fucked up state, so we got no other choice but to drag ourselves. Yeah, this is a bad place to be. I don't like it. Oh yeah, there's Jess's body. Oh, that's so disturbed. And there's Jess's head. Not a lovely sight. Okay, watch this now. I'm probably going to get dragged down to the bottom by the Wendigo. I'm calling it. That's exactly what's going to happen. Oh, I saw that. I totally saw that. Oh, well, Mike got dragged down. <gasps> Oh, that's pretty real. <gasps> that is Hannah. Jesus. Oh, you're such a coward. That's still alive. I mean, that's good. Uh, 
Ah, you take the matchbox, you put your hand on the lamp, you lift it up like so, and whoosh. There we go. Yeah, your most proudest achievement to date. And look, there goes being uh, absolutely spastic again. Right, so multiple pathways. So we could go this way, can we? Uh, let's not. Let's not go down any further. Okay, track back this way a small bit just in case there is something hiding behind here. And look, there is another totem. And again, you can see for yourselves my lamp is going completely batshit crazy. Either that, or it too is scared out of its mind. Even though it's an inanimate object. Objects have feelings too. Oh, that's Mike! Okay, let's try and avoid that, shall we? Actually, I just want to see how many totems I've left to collect. Quite a few. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine. Oh, so I'm guessing I probably might have missed one or two. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, nine, definitely nine. And I think this glitch with the lantern, I think it's only on the PS5. Something to do with the compatibility of the PS4 game. Or PS4 titles. Something to do with frame rates as well, I'm not sure. I'm not sure of the technicalities be behind these glitches. But as long as I can play the majority of my PS4 games on my PS5, I am happy out. Would you? I wish it was like the Xbox One X and Series X though. They absolutely nailed backwards compatibility. I mean, even if I could stream PS1 games and PS2 games via uh, PlayStation Now and PS3 games through PlayStation Now, that would be awesome. I'm talking about like the nearly the entire... Uh, backlog or the entire um, library of PS1, PS2, PS3 games. Like, I would gladly pay 10, 15 euro a month for that if I had access to the entire library. Oh, what was that? Took the words right out of my mouth. Uh, we'll just hide. That's the best idea. Hide, 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 hide. Don't move. Not moving. Not moving. Okay. Jesus. Oh, was that a bad idea? Oh, oh God. Uh, breakthrough. Come on. Oof. Hey, at least we're outside. <gasps> Don't move. Don't move. Not moving. Not moving. Not moving. Oh, and we're only a hop, skip, and a jump away from the lodge now. Okay, that's great. Jesus, look at Sam go. She definitely came well prepared. Uh. 
Okay, you go, girl. You can do this. Come on. Think of the tiger. Of the tiger. Go on. Yeah. <gasps> oh, shoot. Come on. Try one last time. Go on. Go, 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 go. Come on, grab the overhang. It's circle, right? Oh no, triangle. Yeah, there you go. Okay, is this the best way to go? Ah, uh, yeah, I think both roads lead to home. Oh, told him I would have missed this. So what is this one? Death? Oh no, it's danger. If I manage to get all totems, I would be so happy. But I don't think I will. Let's go to war an extra playthrough to get all the collectibles. Like I said, uh, I will be playing through the majority of these games to get the Platinum. Because I even played through the first episode of Life is Strange there on the PS4 just yesterday. Got all the trophies in that first episode, but to get the Platinum you need all five episodes. And the trophies are easy enough to get, they're all the um, photo opportunities. But I won't be buying the episodes just yet. Not until they drop in price again. So maybe there's going to be a September sale at some point or an October sale. Jeez, I seem to be talking about more, more about... Uh, Life is strange than this actual game here. <laughs> kind of ironic. Okay, and down we go. Watch the ankles, watch the ass. Oh! Frickin' nailed it. I mean, that's how I start every morning. Getting out of bed, sliding down, falling out of my ass and landing face first. That's the best way to start the morning. Gets your blood going. <gasps> Minus the scary Wendigos. Oh, watch your head, watch your head. Oh, oh, oh. Nice. See the way she just par absolutely parkour that shit. Hey! Hey! Oh, come on, open up! Bust open the window. Are you in there? Let me in. Bust it open. Sam. Jesus. Mike. You okay, Mike? Gosh. You look terrible. It's gonna look worse if we stay out here. Come on. And you're not going to ask about Josh. Oh, smash it. That's the way to do it. No, leave that off. What do you think we should do? We should check the basement. Might be someone left down there. Oh, good idea. Wait a 
Is that snow? Or dust? You know, ain't that's a cool particle effect. I like using that particle effect in my thumbnails as well. Jesus! Lock it, lock it, lock it! Oh, you idiot! No, I thought it would have stopped him anyway. I'm cheating because I've the controller on my leg. Now moving, now moving. Still not moving. One. Oh, Jesus. Talk about the Alpha Wendigo. Oh, I know what you're thinking, Mike. Okay, choices have to be made here. Look at that for Mortal Kombat Fatality. Oh wait, is that Hannah there? Ow. And he bolted like an idiot. Save Mike. Save Mike. Hey. Oh, you cowards. Just really curious if this is um, Hannah. Oh, it is. It is. She had a mark on her head. And she has a tattoo. I'm moving. Keep fighting, keep fighting. Oh, Mike, you're not going to leave me here by myself, are you? Oh, that is nuts. Oh, no. Over. 
Yeah, I got a gold trophy. Oh man, I can't believe I cocked that up. I had the controller on my leg and everything just to keep it steady because I don't trust my unsteady hands. Right, and so that's the ending. I know there's... Whoa. There's multiple endings, I think. Based on how many survivors you save. But I think the overall penultimate... No! Penultimate... Penultimate ending is the one where you save all the survivors. And make all the right choices. Oh. The one character... I liked above all of them, which was um, uh, Ashley. I don't, I don't she had to die. Why? You said you thought he was stalking you at first. Did anyone else in your group think that? Oh well, yeah. <laughs> Is it possible they could have killed him? What? They? No. No, you, you, you don't understand. Don't you understand? Well, he attacked you. He saved my life, and I watched him die. He held it right up to my face. This right is just them right um, interviews. Nose, and he could have shot me. He almost shot me. The prick. I mean, you go out with a guy for however long, and you think you know him, but man, this one really takes the cake. I was right there, and I could have done something. I tried to do something. Wasn't good enough. He was out of his fucking mind. He wanted to hurt us. Okay? And I thought he was the one who attacked Jess. Why did you hit Josh? He, he was acting like a maniac, and I I had to stop him. I thought you said he was tied up. Yeah, but. Understand. He was trying to fuck with our heads. Where's Matt? Is he okay? Are they done looking at him? I'm just a little worried because, you know, I'm his girlfriend. Did he tell you that? I mean, I probably wasn't his favorite person there for a couple minutes, but he knows how devoted I am to him. He knows. I mean, he said he knows, right? Enough. It was so close, man. If I had just been just a little faster, I, just, I could have saved her. I could have saved her. So it's my fault. And the reason Jess is dead. Josh helped us, and then... Fuck, man. <laughs> that thing, okay, the Wendigo, it came out of the darkness, and it just... <sighs> I don't know. I heard screaming. I got out of there. There's no point in both of us dying. Okay, I think that's it with the interviews. Yeah, I'm just gonna skip this because of, you know, copyrighted music here. Oh. What's this now? Oh, that's Josh. He's turned into a Wendigo.
Okay, episodes. I just want to see. Oh, yeah. I can go back through the different episodes and make different choices. Ah, okay. That's good. That, that, that's just that's very good. I don't have to play through the whole game in its entirety. Ah, right. Do I have time? No, I don't have time. Um, unlike the... Excuse me. <laughs> unlike Life is Strange, um, where I did have the time and where I wanted to go back and get the second ending, I did that because it didn't take it any time. Uh, I was able to select the last episode and save. Or sorry, yeah. Go back to the last episode and get two endings first. But I'm not... But this, <laughs> <laughs> but uh, this isn't Life is Strange, this is Until Dawn. So yeah, what I will be doing is I'll be going back through this game in my own time, getting the different endings, getting the, all the collectibles, going through the different trophies. I'll just show you them here very briefly. Jesus Christ, I, I only got five? Five trophies out of 19. Oh, okay, that makes sense. All of these are hidden. Yeah... I mean, not not a lot. I I reckon I could, I could easily get get these within a day or so. Because I haven't gotten a platinum in ages. And as you can see here, Life is Strange got all the trophies for the first episode. Easy peasy. Lots of trophies, lots of games. So thoughts and opinions of the game. I uh, yeah. Again, like I say about most games, I enjoy playing. Very well grounded. Had a good story, and I like that it was based on uh, folklore of the Wendigo, and it was even popularized by many creepypasta narrators out there on YouTube. Mr. Creepypasta, Creepypasta Jr., Creeps MacPasta, those uh, three guys uh, more or less popularized it in you know, uh, social media in terms of YouTube videos going back about... When, was, when did I start watching or listening to Creepy Bastards back in 2011, 2012, almost over 10 years ago? And those guys have blown up since, and I still like to listen to their videos on, you know, scary stories. They help me sleep at night. <laughs> it's weird. I like listening to them. It's something about their voices that are so soothing, even though they're reading creepy stories. But then again, I do love me my horror. I watch quite a bit of horror movies when I get the chance. Speaking of which, I haven't watched any in ages. Now, I really want to see the new Conjuring as well. Might see if you can stream that somewhere or download it, I don't know. Legally. Support the movies. Either way, like I said, I enjoyed the game, enjoyed it thoroughly. Um, are there things that could have been done better? Sure, I mean, I thought the controls were a bit clunky here and there. I'm not very good at articulating my feelings about games. Other than saying, yeah, I liked it, it's good, well-grounded, like the characters and whatnot. Like, I'm not, not going to fluff it out for the sake of adding a few extra minutes to a video. I mean, there's no point, really. But like I said, I did enjoy it. I'd recommend anyone to download it. And if you do have a PS5, it's for free on the PlayStation Plus collection, which you can go to right now. Let me show you again. I've showed this off before, but I'll show it off again. Get all these games for free. When you get a PS5 as long as you have a PlayStation Plus subscription. I mean, there's not a lot of games out for the PS5 at the moment in terms of exclusivity. But god damn, if you haven't played any of these games, you should. Especially Uncharted 4. Uncharted 4, which is being remastered on a PS5. So I will be getting that, playing through it at some point. I was going to play through Uncharted 4 on the PS4. Or at least the PS4 version, I should say. On my PS5, if I completed 2 and 3. But as you can tell on my channel, I take a while putting out any type of content. Eh, but you know, it's, it's a matter of balance. Balancing my work life with pleasure and social doesn't really leave me with a lot of time to focus on creating content, unfortunately. I mean, to be honest, YouTube is a hard thing to break into at the moment. I mean, lots of people are doing the same thing as I am. They're even doing it better than I can. And I have no problem with that. I mean, I'm, I can freely admit that. But there are some people who are so butthurt about not being able to, you know, get subscribers easily, that they use these straw man arguments that, oh god, I'm being discriminated against. Clearly it's something to do with the algorithm, it's nothing to do with the algorithm. It's just, YouTube isn't competitive as it once was, and that's just using your noggin. 
I mean, I know it. Everybody else know, knows this, but some people just can't accept it. Okay, that's my little rant over with. I don't know how it evolved into that. But like I said, I enjoyed the game. I will be uh, playing over it at some point again. And I will be finishing up Uncharted 2. Or sorry, I will be getting back to Uncharted 2 with the next video. So I have to catch up at that series and then start another one at some point. Probably get back to Shenmue. Because Shenmue is another very good game that I want to get back in into. Very nostalgic. Ugh, I've rambled on for too long now. Anyway guys, you know what to do. If you did enjoy this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. Comment, favorite, share. Leave a nasty or little comment in the comment section below. And of course, like always, I will see you in the next one. So on to the next time. See ya.